Good morning. This is Pastor Jason of Kona Faith Center with a word for today. And the word for today is three. Ask, seek, knock. I don't think I have a full understanding of what Jesus is saying here. The King of Kings, the Lord of Lords, the Master of the Universe, the One who owns it all, the Unlimited Creator, the All-Knowing One, the All-Powerful One says, Ask. Everyone who asks receives. If this is true, and though every man is a liar, God cannot lie, why am I not asking more? My take is that I should be asking with the right attitude for the right reasons and in line with his will. But if Jesus says ask and then emphatically states that I will receive, asking should move up on my priority list. Jesus says that those who are evil know how to give good things to their children. He also says the Father who is good and good only will give much more to those who ask. My kids do not ask for their needs to be met. We met their needs. I don't think they even thought about having their basic needs met. They weren't concerned about food, shelter, clothing. They were focused on what they wanted. They asked for what they wanted. How much more should I be asking for what I want from my Father God? My kids had to ask for things they wanted several times before I started paying attention. And this was so that I would know that they really wanted them and it was not just a passing fancy. How much more should I ask for what I want? I think there's a much higher level of revelation in this asking than I'm currently operating at. Now, I want to take the limits off the all-knowing, all-powerful, good and good-only Father God this year. So Lord, I'm asking for that divine revelation on ask this year. Seek. Everyone who seeks finds. Amazing. My current definition of seek is asking for frequent consultations with Father God to inquire. I think seek is obviously related to ask. In the same way that my ask needs to grow to another level, my seek needs to grow to another level. In the same way that my ask needs to be about what I want, my seek needs to set higher goals. Now, I want to seek him in everything, both small and big, but it's time to take the limits off the all-knowing, all-powerful Father God. I think this means that I will have to take the time to think. John Maxwell calls this reflective thinking. I want to take the time this year to think about what it is I'm really looking for, what it is I really want. Want. I want to take the time for frequent consultations with Father God who knows everything so he can help me to receive what it is that I am really seeking for. Knock and it will be open to me. I want to find the right doors and boldly but not arrogantly knock on those doors until they are open to me. This makes me think of the scripture that says, boldly come before the throne of grace. It also makes me think of persistence, perseverance, and patience. My sense is that Father God is ready, willing, and able to do exceedingly abundantly above all that I can ask or even think. It is time. This is a year for me to take the limits off of Father God and ask, seek, knock. The word for today is three. God bless. Check in tomorrow.